Christina Mondragon in St. Landry Parish, where I spent some time with an Opelousas council member talking about the life of her brother. He was killed earlier this morning at this house behind me. Councilwoman Chastity Davis tells me the violence has to stop. It hurts. It, it really hurts. Opelousas Councilwoman Chastity Davis is the younger sister of John Davis, who she tells me was found shot to death Tuesday morning in his trailer here in St. Landry Parish. John was just released after serving the last eight years at a correctional facility in Claiborne, Louisiana. He just got out of prison oh, a week ago, a little a week ago, and um, he was able to spend Christmas with us for the first time in a very long time. I spoke to fellow Opelousas council member and friend Marvin Richard, who says the timing of this crime makes this even harder to understand. You know, we have a beautiful holiday, families enjoying one another out of town and having a great time. And someone took out holiday busy schedule to commit this crime. I reached out to the Opelousas Police Department for more information, but at this time, I have not heard back. The family of John Davis tells me after being away for so long, it's sad that he only had a short time with his loved ones. In regards to his past, he still was a good person. And it's just, you know, when you go ahead and kill somebody, you don't realize you're taking away from their family. Davis says the home was not broken into and nothing was taken. They are urging anyone who may have seen something to come forward and contact the police. In St. Landry Parish, Christina Mondragon, KTC TV3.